Uh, people living in a Luzerne County neighborhood tonight say that they are living in fear of violence from Hazleton area high school students. Eyewitness News first told you about the problems in a live stream on PAHomepage.com earlier this afternoon. And our I team's Andy Mahalshik joins us live from West Hazleton tonight with more on the story. Andy. Well, good evening, Nick. People who live here along Allen Street in West Hazel say they're sick and tired of the violence and the trouble caused by some of the students who walk through here on Allen Street on their way home from the Hazel Area High School, which is about three blocks away from here. They say they want it to end once and for all. This has become an all too common sight in this West Hazel neighborhood a huge police presence. The kids are just way out of hand. It's getting ridiculous. This actually started for us personally in October. Um, I caught that fight on camera um, and I posted it and that's when I started noticing that all the neighbors were having similar issues. This video of students fighting was taken by a neighbor several days ago. This is the kind of thing that neighbors say had become all too common as students from the nearby Hazel Area High School walk home after school. So about a week ago, um, there was a large group of people outside. I heard yelling. I came out. There was three, three of them beating on one kid. So I told them to step back. I had to pull my mace out. They started gathering around me. Um, they promised that they'd return with more people and that they were going to shoot me. Tyler Sandrock says the violence has been escalating. Yeah, there's fights all the time. Um, they usually went somewhere else, but now it's here and they just, they just don't care about what they do to everybody's property. The police chief sent this message to parents. Probably the parents should indicate to their children as they are walking home um, to walk on the sidewalks. We don't want to see anybody get hit and ultimately it is the parent's responsibility. If we cite the child, the parent is the one that's going to ultimately be able to, or, or responsible to pay that citation and that fine. And some neighbors also came out of their homes this afternoon while we were here and said they were glad to see eyewitness news in the neighborhood putting a spotlight on the problems and their concerns, hoping that that spotlight will help resolve those problems. Reporting live in West Hazleton, Luzerne County, Andy Mahal, Eyewitness News. Nick? Well, those neighbors are concerned there. Andy, thanks. And the police have cited several students for the walking in the middle of the road issues. Chief Buglio says that officers will maintain a presence in that neighborhood as long as it takes to make sure that everyone is safe out there.